right now let's get into the in-depth review series. Uh, this is going to be the in-depth review series uh, video one. Here is the deluxe edition of Metallica Kill Em All. No, this is not an original. This is a the 2008 Warner remaster. That sounds just fine. Comes with the lyrics. Uh, vintage photos. Two R uh, 45 RPM vinyls. Recorded for optimum sound quality. Master of Puppets original music for nations. Uh, this is uh, pink vinyl. Does not come with uh, any inserts. Mine didn't. This is fairly uh, easy to pick up. You can find it at your local uh, retailer or on Amazon or any other. Uh, Eel.com, which is E I L.com, you might be able to find it on there. Pops up on there every now and then, I'm sure. And this one sounds just fine. Now, the 33 RPM edition of the 2008 remaster of Metallica's Ride of Lightning. This one sounds pretty good if you compare them to the 45s. Doesn't sound quite as good, but it's good enough. Uh, you got uh, redone artwork here. It's not redone, it just looks better than the originals, I'm sure. But it's more bright. That's one thing I noticed about it. Uh, sounds great. Comes with a insert, kind of like the uh, deluxe edition, just like this. this. Is the 45 RPM edition? Sounds a lot better. Here you get um, two 45s RPM vinyls. That sound great on a high-end system or low-end, or even Bose headphones. And those will, I will uh, review at a later date. Actually, pretty soon. This is the same here. The only difference between this and the regular edition is this is actually paper right here. This is the front and back paper. This right here is a fold out. And Nirvana's never mind. This, I believe, it might just might be a bootleg. Only because it it looks strange. It look the covers or the the vinyl paper topping on it is very faded. Here's a green vinyl. What's going on here? There we are. With the green vinyl. For some reason these are getting nicked. I don't know why. All my vinyls are getting nicked. All of a sudden they're breaking. I don't know what the cause of this is, but I'm going to have to get down to it. This is not cool at all for this to happen. There's the green swirl vinyl. It needs to be cleaned. I don't think I've cleaned it. Sooner or later I'll get a stand and we'll I'll start standing these up. Anyways, George Carlin's Toledo window boxes can also be found on CD. Not really much to say about this one. That one's fine. Um, it's just a comedy album. I wonder if there's good ones. I'm not going to have this very much longer. Since I already have it on CD. And tools. Um, Lateralis. Limited edition. Two full color picture discs. And this can be picked up for $39.98 plus tax. I have not opened this and probably will not be opening it. And look out for part two.